Uh, I assume you don't okay. agree with Amnesty International and these other human rights groups. Well, I mean, they're entitled to their view that they don't have to foot the bill nor face the significant issues which, uh, which our country faces. I mean, there are 110,000 people in our nation right now who are still waiting to find out whether they're going to be allowed to stay or go. We should not be having this conversation in a kind of logical manner because there is no logic in allowing tens of hundreds of thousands of people to come across the channel. It's as straightforward as that. In saying that, I mean, the reason we've got 110,000 people still waiting to find out whether they can stay in the country is because the processing is horrifically slow. We're going to do a report in a couple of minutes where there's a distinct lack of doctors and nurses in our health service. We know that in every sector of the economy, there's a real shortage of workers. Would it make more sense to process these claims quicker and potentially get some of these people into work? Uh, well, no, I'm not in favour. I'm, de I'm definitely not in favour of that particular idea. I must be honest, I'm much more in favour of Truss's idea, which is opening up uh, other opportunities in Africa um, for people to wait wait there rather than... Because if we gave the signal to the Middle East or to most of Africa that you can come over here and basically would give you a visa, forget about 110,000 people waiting for their visas, there would be about 10 million, perhaps 50 million people coming here. You know, we are not the solution to the global problems of people uh, struggling uh, to find work. And it is unfair to lump it on us. And anyway, these people are coming through other countries. Why don't those other countries simply take them if that is the case? But look, at the end of the day, there is no doubt that one of the reasons why Truss is going to win by a country mile over Rishi is that she uh, believes fervently in the Rwanda plus uh, prospect for migrants. Any politician, Labour, Lib Dem, Tory, whatever, who came up with a solution to the channel migrants issue would win an election, hands down, which is the only reason I, I, I believe that Starmer is going to win by a country mile, unfortunately. But it's the only reason why there's a question mark about Starmer and friends.